Come on, Caleb. I know you want to, or well, I don't, but I'm gonna pretend you do. Hello, everybody, MM Line, and welcome to my channel, and welcome back to A to Z Baby Challenge. So, we are picking up pretty much right where we left off. I am so excited to get our first adult and just have some more birthdays. So, I've already brought up the cake, and all that is left to do is just age these guys up. So, pretty much who we are aging up today is Amelia and uh, Fiona. What is happening? Why can't I use it? Why can't I use it? Okay, I guess we're gonna have to make a new cake. I'm just gonna go ahead and say right away, put your name suggestions down below. So, it's G, H, and I that you can put name suggestions to because soon we will get more babies. Or maybe I don't have to put an I actually because I don't think we will have enough space for triplets. Maybe baby. What is she wearing though? Where are my sims getting all of these horrible outfits from? Uh, where are you going? You're about to pee yourself. Don't go and chat with your brother now. Okay, Fiona aged up. So I got my randomizer. Uh, she will be vegetarian. Awesome. <sighs> I don't mind vegetarians per se. It's just you have to be so cautious with what you make them. What is his name? Cody. I'm pretty sure Co Cody or Brandon is sitting right here in the corner right now. He's super sad because he accidentally because I accidentally made him eat something with meat. And then her aspiration will be the rambunctious scamp. Add some birthday candles and then you can go ahead and blow up the candles. We're getting our first adult, which is really exciting because then I get to show you guys the house that I built. I'm gonna go over her just outfits really fast just to make sure that her outfits look okay. And I will also give Fiona a little bit of a makeover so she will get the art lover. So let's see, where is it? There we go. Okie dokie. So let's take a look at their. Um, let's actually do castful Edimo first. Okay, so let's take a look at their, um, their looks. Okay, so this is what Amelia looks like all grown up. She pretty much looks the exact same. And she's, you know, she's pretty. I like her. And also between episodes, I did change the boys, like their faces and profile. So they now, you know, won't poke someone's eye out with their chin or nose. But they pretty much look the exact same from the, like in the front. And this is what Fiona looks like. She's so cute. She has her mother's eyes, just like all of them. But I have changed those eyes now. So hopefully we won't get these. Don't get me wrong. It's just those eyes, these eyes can just look a little bit weird to me. This, uh, these are all of her outfits. I went with pretty much all like presets because I really can't be bothered anymore. I'm just gonna leave her in her outfits that she had as a teen and now I'm going to move her out which is so exciting. So before I move her in I'm just gonna show you the house. This is the house what it looks like. Um, it has eight bedrooms, two bathrooms, <laughs> two bathrooms. I know I'm very generous right? I kind of wanted to get you know like a farmish look on it i failed i definitely feel like it looks horrible it's not a good looking house i'm not a builder as i said multiple times if you're new to my channel i'm not a builder i'm not a good builder but yeah this is pretty much what the house looks like um i spent a lot of time on this and it doesn't really show i don't know it just i guess it, i mean it gets the job done i wanted something like this because i was kind of inspired by the um, farm, like the green farm from The Walking Dead, from the series, not from the game. So this is what you see when you come in. This is just a living area. I made sure to put in a lot of like seating so everyone could sit down and watch TV together if they wanted to. I put it in a piano because there was just a lot of dead space and I just didn't know what to put there. Uh, you come in here and here is the like kitchen. Um, it's kind of small. I wanted to put the kitchen here first and this would be the dining area. It's just couldn't really get the dining like the table to look good because this is a table with eight seats and there will be eight sims living in here so uh, and also the kitchen became way too big so i just ended up with this little um floor plan or whatever and then you come in here here is one of the bathrooms and i don't think there is a bathroom no i never put a bathroom upstairs both bathrooms both bathrooms are downstairs all the bedrooms are upstairs this is just with a tub and a shower and then you come out here and then you're back in the living room and here is another small bathroom with another shower and then you come upstairs and here's a little hallway the bedrooms is not very like fair like these bedrooms aren't big but they are bigger and they're very plain and boring at this point when i was just furnishing all of this i was so just tired of decorating because I just spent like the whole downstairs and I don't know I was just kind of tired you can see I kind of gave up on the whole decoration upstairs but this is pretty much just what it looks like all the rooms have like different colors so this is the house that they will be living in and I just realized that this is like pointing up that is not okay hold up 
Okay, I got it. This is what the kids will be living in when they move out. This is where Amelia will move in on her own now to begin with. It's gonna be a big empty house for her, but um, Cody and Brandon will not be far behind. I'm gonna check once we get back, but I'm pretty sure I get to age them up really soon as well. So I'm gonna make a new household and just gonna put her in there. Let's move her in. Okay, here we go. Uh, free real estate on. We're just gonna put her in there and then I'm just gonna rename A to Z. Or actually, let's do, so how, which letters will it be? So we'll go to H. So A to H. We'll live in here, babies. Let's hop right on back into the family and let's see what, like, what grades the other, like, the twins have, Cody and Brandon. Okay, so Cody and Brandon are B students. We will be age, uh, able to age them up in the next episode. Actually, we can afford to get like a tub and a shower combined. So let's do that. You can go to bed right away. Hold up, isn't that bed claimed? Never mind. This was June's bed. Or a no, not June. Now I don't remember her name. She moves out and I just forget all about her right away. How are all of that? She's a B student. So we're going to have a huge birthday party in the next one. We'll be aging up a lot of kids. And then we also got Caleb. So he just continues needs to come back to our door but you know let's make him a victim let's just chat him up and just become friends with him and then we will just you know force him to make a baby with us we have six people in our household right now so if she gets pregnant now she she will probably be able to have at most twins. By the way, hold up. She has 895 satisfaction points. Fertile, okay, it's 3,000, but maybe, hold up, maybe we can do, could really use only a line. Um, can we invite him in or is he already like allowed to come in? And then we're gonna begin, you know, being a little bit flirty with him because we really want some more babies and he is a good looking sim. He could use a makeover. Maybe I will give him one. Is Caleb and, um, what's your face? The, uh, the other vampire, Lilith. I'm pretty sure they are siblings, right? Because otherwise this can get kind of awkward. I don't want to risk, you know, coming in between two vampires. I feel like that could be dangerous. Okay, we can f have a first kiss already. Okay. Oh, I have to go to with work to her, with her. So I'm thinking I'm actually going to do that tomorrow, like off screen, so you guys don't have to come. I'm going to have to try and figure that out. Oh my gosh, that interaction. Okay, let's go and try for a baby. Come on, Caleb. I know you want to, or well, I don't, but I'm going to pretend you do. Let's have some half vampire babies here. Are you guys not... What? Is... Why is my game so laggy today? There we go. Let's try this again, shall we? I still have a gathering let's stop the gathering and then we're also going to add fiona can we like kick out how do you kick out someone only club leaders can disband group wait who is club leader brandon so can he make someone else club leader okay let's kick amelia i'm probably gonna ha have to make brandon cancel his um membership once he becomes a young adult did i mess up did i not save nope okay there we go okay now that you guys are done let's go and check if she is pregnant i could use mc command center but let's do this legit cody starts work in one hour Eating for two, she is pregnant. Okay, awesome. So he's gonna have to get up really soon. I am fe I'm feeling so bad for Cody. Oh, what does it say? Uh, chance of twins from Law Trait. Feeling pretty pumped. June's chances of having twins are high. I hope so, because we really want multiple kids here. I'm probably gonna have to play a little bit off screen, and then I will leave the kids that will get an A today on A for one more day, so Cody also gets a chance to get an A, so I can age up everyone at once. How about you just, like, talk a little bit with him? What what does he do for a living? Hold up. What is his career? Does he have a career? What do you do for a living? Or, well, for death. Considering he's a vampire. I don't know. What do you say? Do you say for a living? He's a mailroom technician at Dewey How Dewey Ch Cheatham? Chatham? Ch Cheatham? And how incorporated I'm not sure what that means at all you know what i'm just gonna wrap this up really fast i'm gonna take a photo with uh caleb first so we can put him on our, on our wall i'm pretty sure we got all of them all of the baby fathers on the wall so i'm gonna take a picture and then i'm gonna send her off to work on her own oh my gosh are you kidding me no you can leave now we're gonna take a photo with you take a photo with caleb stop walking caleb and then you can leave because otherwise you're probably gonna burn up i think they would make a really nice couple okay hopefully one of them are good all right then i'm going to wrap it up here i hope you guys enjoyed i did i think this series is so much fun um if you did enjoy then don't forget to leave a like don't forget to comment down below and don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to press the notification bell so you get a notification every single time i upload a new video which is pretty much every tuesday through saturday take care and i'm gonna talk to you guys later
Bye.